Hi everybody and welcome. My name is Yonata Scalo and today I'm going to teach in this tutorial how to make this uh, wonderful candle holder. As you can see I'm using the translucent colors from Fimo, red, yellow and uh, translucent. I'm using a camper cutter and new extruder and this is the disc with the many holes that I'm going to use. In this tutorial I'm using this wonderful extruder and uh, there is an, an important thing that you need to know about it that uh, it's not like the other extruder that uh, we have. Inside here there is a plastic piece that uh, helps to push the clay out and we need to take it out and clean it. Here is how you get it out. Here it is. And before you insert the clay inside you need to put it in. The wonderful thing about this extruder is that you can take this handle off and here you have a, a hexagon and you can use a drill that I have added an 8mm bit to it and uh, help you uh, twist this uh, extruder. So I'm going to open it up. Now I need to push this uh, plastic thing inside. For this purpose it's a little bit hard to push. I take a handle like this and it goes right inside. Now the extruder is ready to use. I've conditioned the clay and I run it through the pasta machine on number 3. Now I'm using this camper cutter, I'm going to cut uh, 6 circles out of the red, another 6 out of the yellow and 13 circles out of the translucent. Now I'm going to build the log that will uh, go inside the extruder. I'm doing it like this. One piece of translucent, one piece of yellow, another translucent, and now a piece of red. Another translucent, and now a piece of yellow. Translucent, and red. Translucent, and yellow. Okay, that's enough. I'm rolling this a little bit so it will be easier to insert into the extruder. And now I'm going to push all the clay out.
This is the glass that I'm going to cover. I'm starting in the lower section of the glass, pressing the clay onto the glass and moving around it. The last piece ended up with the yellow, so I am taking the yellow side of this piece to continue. This is now ready for baking. I will bake it uh, for 30 minutes on the temperature that is written on the package of the clay. Enjoy! The credit for this tutorial goes to my son Guy. He wanted so much to play with the new extruder that he came up with this uh, wonderful idea. <laughs>